Welcome guys to Reaction and Review. When I'm reacting to something on internet, and after that, I'm gonna reviewing it. Uh, with me, I'm Michael Apan. So, today we are gonna react to a Myriad Chaosian trial, a trailer. The story of Tianzhou, a status of the five dragons. So, this is another uh, Honkai trial uh, video that being released like uh, three or four hours ago. So, let's jump into it. So let's go. Sorry, I forget. Okay, but so here we go. Hmm. I have traversed great lengths seeking a piece of history, the history okay. of long the permanence. I, too, know little of the progenitor of all dragons. Before the dawn of history, long oh, traversed the burgeoning chaos, seeking the answer to existence. And on Do that exist? path, the revelation of the permanence was unraveled. Then oh. came our emergence, us, long scions. I visited oh. Leonis, a world encircled by five sons. The giant dragon sat overseeing the turning of day and night, the change of seasons, sheltering the lives within. Could the revelation of the permanent signify the timeless nature of one's greatness? The relentless oh. pursuit of individual immortality will only breed an unending multitude of malevolent creatures. Such is the fallacy of the plague's author. So then does the permanence represent the continuance of bloodline? Wow, I'm sorry to uh, cut it, but man, story is so good, man. So this is the the origin of the Xiangdo, or more precisely, part of a uh, permanence. Here we go, man. So then, that the permanence represent continuous upward line. Yeah. I also journey to the ancestral home of the Infernalian people, in the land of white embers. The undead dragon Typhon's breath showered flames on the land below, bringing forth a flourishing lineage. Long scions are dispersed throughout countless worlds, living in solitude. In the vastness of the universe, the rise and fall of one race is of little consequence. It is said that the Vidyatara formed an alliance with the Xianzhou. And that five elders descended upon the mortal realm to keep watch over the plague mobs. Perhaps the permanence is the noble ambition that ensures the safety of the universe. Wow. Alas, Imbibitor Lune forsook his oath, causing a state of great disorder. The High Elders, too, bear mortal frailties, their heavy burdens ultimately becoming the shackles which bind them. From your perspective, what does the Permanence's revelation truly signify? As the sun and moon rise and fall, the world undergoes continuous change, so the concept of stability I just realized there is a lot of a dragon name in here. The world undergoes continuous change. Yeah, we think. That's one of the winged dragon. Sovereign of the storm. So the concept of stability is meaningless. Only by comprehending and aligning with the way of the world can one's path lead to everlasting existence. Countless. Gladiator Meru. New creations emerge when one dragon meets its end among the morning stars. For the Vidyatara, this is the true teaching of the per. On Reddit. I'm still wondering uh what the origin uh where is the origin of a video drug? 
Within the cycle of life, any endpoint may mark the inception of a new journey. And for him, it is no different. Man, this is so uh, cryptic. And also so more poetic. Same time. I couldn't like thinking like like one time thing. I think I will say it again. Uh, this time I will um cut it a bit, just yes, a little bit. Okay, let's cut, uh, cut it a bit. Uh, we are like chopping it like a uh, bit by bit. I have traversed great lengths. Is it the that hung boy? Seeking a piece of history, the history of long the permanence. I too know. I too. Who this person? There's a two talking, uh, like two person talking to each other. But mostly there's a uh, old man voice that talk. Oh, almost all in this uh, video. And also there is a uh, something behind. I see this uh, person is always um like fear sometime in the video. Like I see it like um maybe more than two. But let's see. This is the first one. This uh, uh person with big uh, big eyes. Uh like big one eyes. Okay, let's see. Little of the progenitor of all dragons. Here we go. This is the origin of all dragon. Before the dawn of the progenitor of progenitor of all dragon. dragons. Before the dawn of history, long traversed the burgeoning chaos, seeking the answer to existence. And on that path, the revelation of the permanence was unraveled. So basically. This is uh th this dragon is kinda like all my D and he kinda like okay let's make something uh permanent so here we go I think this this egg is uh become a planet then came our emergence us long scions long scion long is not um uh, long in English uh, language, long in the uh, Chinese language, long is dragon. So just so you know. So yeah, cyan. Okay, okay. I I don't know what is cyan mean. Wait, wait a minute. I'm sorry. <laughs> I know about the Chinese, but not the English one. Oh, like uh, descendant. Ah. The standard of the dragon. Okay, got it, got it. Here we go. I visited Leon. Yeah, this is the planet, I think. Layeris. A world and cycle by five sun. Wow. If I'm not wrong, it's kind of similar with... Um, what is it called? Um, the, uh, the journey to the west. When uh, Tom Sam Chong... Sun Wokong, uh, Brother Sa, and Chupat Thai is uh, walking before they uh, reach uh, Nirvana. Uh, can, I, can I Nirvana is? The, the last step is for, from the, the long story. is uh, walking in the place that there is uh, 5 or 7 is uh, sun. It's kind of similar with uh, Unit to the West. Okay, let's move on. A world encircled by five suns. Five star, maybe the five star is representing uh, representation. <laughs> representation of the five dragon. Dions. I visited Liaris, a world encircled by five suns. The giant dragon sat overseeing the turning of day and night, the change of scene. Yeah, there, there you go. Reasons. Shelter the lives within. Could the revelation of the permanence.
signify the timeless nature of one's greatness. The relentless pursuit of individual immortality. There you go. This is to remind me of um, Raiden Shogun in uh, Genshin Impact that want to be uh, immortal. Just a little note. He will only breed an unending multitude of malevolent creatures. Such is the fallacy of the plague. That is the fallacy of the plague author. Fallacy. Fallacy of the plague author. Okay, uh, I don't understand at all. So then does the permanence represent the continuance of bloodline? I also journey to the ancestral home of the inf Infernalian people. Infernalian? It's kind of like uh, that was a like um, like kind of hell. Infernal. It can be uh, being uh, say that infernal is not about uh, kind of the hell is, but more toward the the light. Infernal kind of like a light. Can be like this uh, light people. Ancestral home of Infernalian people. Infernalian people in the land of white embers. The land of white ember. The undead dragon Typhon's breath showered flames on the land below. There you go. I think uh, this is Bahamut. Kaina Bahamut, yeah. Dragon Typhon. So it's uh, wind, not fire. Uh, but but it is a fire, okay, yeah. Type one breath, power flame on the lamp below. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's kind of like Bahamut. Bringing forth a flourishing ring. Long. Showered flames on the land below. Bringing forth a flourishing ring. Long scions are dispersed. Okay, this is done, huh? Absolutely. Long scions are. This is throughout countless world world dispersed. Oh, being uh spread out throughout countless worlds, living in solitude. Got it. In the vastness of the universe. The right and fall of one race is of little consequence. Okay, I think this uh. This is the ship. Maybe, maybe one of the dragon is with a human in the earth, and they are going to the past universe using a Sianzo uh, starship. I thought this is kind of like look like a Sianzo Lofu ship, but I don't know. Rise and fall of one race is of little consequence. It is said that the Vidyadra Vidyadra form an alliance, alliance with Yanzo. Okay. Maybe one dragon is Vidyadra. Okay, we will count every dragon in here. There is one dragon that uh, the origin. Uh, so there is a four left. Formed an alliance with the Xianzhou. And that five elders descended upon the mortal realm. To keep watch over the plague marks. Plague mark. I think uh, they are talking about uh, Marstrak. Perhaps the permanence is the noble ambition that ensures the safety of the universe. <sighs> Alas, imbibe to lunar. Here we go. Dan Hang again, man. Dan Hang, the one who make everything messed up. forsook his oath causing a state of great disorder the high elders too bear mortal frailties their heavy burdens ultimately becoming the shackles which bind them from your perspective okay. what does the permanence's revelation truly signify as the sun and moon rise here we go here we go we are counting uh, every dragon rise and fall the 
The world undergoes continuous change. So the concept of the concept of stability is meaningless. Hello, room fancy. High elder of the Yao King, successor of the world. Oh, man. The world undergoes continuous change. Hello, room fancy. High elder of the Yao King, processor of the uh, process. <laughs> Let's test of the Winged Dragon. Sovereign of Storm. Bound to watch over the Lunar. Embryo. So the concept of stability is meaningless. Only by comprehending and aligning with the way of the world can... Arun's Regia. The High Elder of the... Yu... Yuming? Tester of the Horner Dragon. Yeah. Welder of the Heavenly Flame. Bound to watch over the Primordial Flame. So this is the one in the Infer Infernalian people uh, that being talked before. There is two. Uh, but the, the origin. One's path lead to everlasting existence. Countless new creation. Okay, this one is the ice one. Yes, yes, or marrow. High elder of the Fang Hu. Successor of the Hell Dragon. Namer of a being a frog. Bound to watch over the Miniature myriad. Emerge when one dragon meets its end among the morning stars. And this is the last one. For the Vidyatara, this is the true teaching of the permanence. Riga Mon Grandis. The elder of the Yuku Yuchi Yuchui. Elder of the Tarantino Dragon. Founder of Gongolian Thailand. Bound to watch over the fallen fallen earth. Ah, so this is the one with a Tianzo person, I think. When they are uh, before uh, they, when they are still in the earth. And I think the dragon is uh, following the, uh, their, their path to the galaxy into the in the ship of Xiangzhu Lofu. Within this there you go. That person again. Uh, with a uh, helmet like helmet that being used in what is it called? Uh, not diving, but like old school when people go to the undersea, they are using the, the that that kind of helmet too. Twice we see it twice. Cycle of life. Any endpoint may mark the ins. Okay, before we go here, I think I will go back to the, to the talking because I'm not really hearing it. I just focus on the dragon. As the sun and moon rise and fall, the world undergoes continuous change. So the concept of stability is meaningless. Only by comprehending and aligning with the way of the world can one's path lead to everlasting existence. Count the world can one's path lead only by comprehensive Wait a minute. rise and fall, the world undergoes continuous change. So the concept of stability is meaningless. Only by comprehending and aligning with the way of the world can one's path lead to everlasting existence. Yeah, Countless I'm new creations emerge when one dragon meets its end among the morning stars. For the Vidyatara, this is the true teaching of the permanence. Within the cycle of life. It reminds me of the, the symbol, you know, like a uh, Uruboros. Uh, Uruboros is the symbol, if I'm not wrong. It's the symbol of the... Um, it's kind of like permanent. Uh, the... Like that, it, it's our uh, tail. And it, there is a symbol for the... 
Solomon uh, uh, Solomon Ring. So it's kind of like a big mix up between uh, Western and Middle East, and Western is kind of like mix up. Life. Mixed Any up. end point may mark the inception of a new journey, and for him, it is no different. It's no different. of the permanence within the cycle of life any end point may mark the inception of a new journey yeah and for him it is no different you think blue not green wait a minute Color is changing. There is a blue and a little red, blue, white, and red. Yeah, it's become it is become a uh, green. There you go. It's changing the color, become green, red, and still white. Okay, the blue become green. I don't know what it mean, but this is just uh, being uh, shown a little bit and the video is end I'm still wondering who is the third person uh, the second one I'm still don't know who this person like the old man uh, that uh, monologuing all this video but there is two uh, the third person behind this old man he appeared once and second in this. Within. This is not really a uh, complex like in Kafka video, but I just want to pointing it out. In Kafka video, I'm talking about a lot of symbolism, but this one is more like mixed up. The cycle. So yeah, I think that's it. So. This video is uh quite what should I say um a bit confusing, but also like it's kind of like a more uh what is called uh it's kind of like more property you know like property a lot of like um. I like poetic uh word and a lot of kind of like a uh, ambiguous term yeah so there is a five dragon from one dragon okay so i think the one dragon make uh, the path of permanence and from one dragon is become five dragon and one dragon with uh yang zulofu so Another four is being uh, spread out throughout the galaxy. One in the Infernalian, Infernalian people, but another three I um, still don't know where they are from, uh, they, where they are now. We only have two dragons that we know right now. So, yeah, that's it. I guess, yeah, that's it. So, thank you so much for everyone watching this video. Ampang uh, lima If you like this kind of video, you can support me. Everything in the description, like uh, crypto, PayPal, or Aweria. If you are from Indonesia, so thank you so much. You again. Also, if you want to give uh, some uh, kind of like a recommendation for me to react or analyzing, you can. Uh, just typing it on in a com comment section okay so thank you so much see you again next time bye